Good evening, vloggy vlogsters. Yeah, it's an evening and it's a Monday. Isn't that a treat? Not just starting the vlog at a weekend. Um, but, you know, it's happening. So, uh, hello, welcome to another week. Uh, not as exciting as last week's vlog. Um, last week's vlog, oh, I haven't got a face. Camera doesn't like giving me a face when I'm not wearing makeup. Um, yeah, last week's vlog was my Euro Disney vlog. That wasn't actually last week though. <laughs> because in Vlogland there's been a little bit of a skip because I don't know whether you noticed me looking a little bit tired slash rough at the end of my Disneyland Paris vlog, but I got tonsillitis again. Hooray! Yeah, that's three times this year. Anyway, antibiotics and a week of uh, sitting around watching Netflix later and I am recovered, if a little bit husky, <laughs> and back vlogging again. Um, so this week, what have I got coming up? Oh. <clears throat> you seem to be especially husky, really sorry. Um, this week, what have I got coming up? Uh, tonight I've got the night to myself. I've literally just dropped, I've been working from home all day and then I've just dropped Dan off at his beer club to see his beer friends. Um, and he homebrews, he has homebrew friends now. Um, I have beer everywhere, which actually isn't that terrible, but it is kind of burbling away all the time. Um, so yes, I've just dropped Dan off at his club and I um, have now got the evening to myself to do a bit of editing, which is always good. I've been a bit sneaky and got myself a drive through Mackey D's on the way home. Not so healthy, never mind. It is healthier than it's meant to be because I've got a Sprite. Yep, a crappy Sprite because the milkshake machine wasn't working. Like who has a McDonald's and doesn't want a thick shake? I wanted a chocolate thick shake and it was already too late because I was like in the drive through cars behind me and when I was like, what do you want to go with your meal? And I was like, chocolate shake, please. And he said, no shakes today, sorry, love. And I was like, I just want to reverse out of here. I just want to reverse right out now. I'm, but I had to repress that rage and just say, oh, have a Sprite. Um, so there you go, because uh, I think a Sprite's okay. Basically, I'm really restricted with fizzy drinks um, as far as my allergies are concerned. I'm pretty sure I'm okay with Sprite. I know I'm okay with 7-Up. Pretty sure I'm okay with Sprite. I need to double check that before I drink it. Anyway, so I'm gonna munch on that. I'm gonna do some editing, get um, my Disney vlog all finished. Um, I think I might have another vlog that's finished that just needs posting for this week. I'm a little like two weeks behind, so I just need to get all that up. Um, and then, yeah, the, the world is my oyster for the evening. Who knows, I may even do a blog post. Um, later this week, uh, quite a fun one, or it's meant to be, uh, I've got book club on Wednesday, which is my first book club. <laughs> I have not yet finished the book. I have about 40% of the way through the book. Um, it's been run by the lovely uh, Tash, who uh, you might know as like Nutella Tasha. She runs fantastic food and beauty blogs. Um, she's a great the Rummy blogger. Uh, so yeah, she's just organised a bit of an informal get together, and I haven't finished yet. The book, haven't finished the book yet. But I was speaking to, to her earlier today, like messaging her, and it doesn't seem anyone has. Uh, so I just need to get on that. So that's probably what I need to do tonight. It's Neil Gaiman's everywhere. Um, it's been very, very good. The forty percent I've read of it so far. I totally meant to. Um, I actually went to London this weekend, which I didn't vlog because we were staying with some friends of Dan's, um, and I totally meant to read it on the train there and on the train back and on the train there. Um, I met up with Helga that I used to work with, so work for, so hooray, hi Helga, um, and just chatted to her all the way down, which was great. Um, and then on the way back, I fell asleep because I was maybe a little bit hungover. So I just slept instead. And then, uh, yes, yeah, so that's Wednesday. Nothing else too exciting coming up in the week. And then Saturday, <laughs> I've got like an actual night out planned, like a night out with friends, like young people do. Um, I am, um, sorry, I keep doing this because I've had my hair cut. I had it cut on Friday. And my side bangs, I was like, I want them thicker and I want them a bit shorter. And I think I've possibly gone a bit short for when I've got my glasses on because they kind of sit, I don't know. It'll grow, it'll grow. I've probably just not blow dried it right because I have literally only blow dried my fringe today and put the rest in the flat. Uh, best in the flat, but hey ho. Uh, yeah, proper night out, going, got friends coming round for some quick dinner. Um, probably just do like something in one pot, I think, like a pulled pork or something. Do a bit pre-drinking. And then we booked a karaoke room. <laughs> Haven't done karaoke for blooming ages. I'm so excited, I cannot wait. Let's just hope that my, uh, oh, that my uh, throat has recovered by then, shall we? Anyway, I need to eat my Mackie D. It's gonna have gone cold by now. I'm just 
remembering as I'm finishing my dinner and starting to edit something else exciting that's happening this week. Sunday is Elizabeth and Rosa Lilliam's Mendy night, which I am so excited to go to. I unfortunately can't go to the wedding, which is a real shame, um, but I am going to meet her Mendy night. I'm really excited. I've never been to a Mendy night before, and it would be lovely to see her, because I've not seen her for ages, because she's been so busy with all the wedding planning, which I totally get. You may remember me dropping off the face of the earth about this time last year. Uh, so yeah, excited for that too. Good morning, happy Saturday. So slightly later than advertised, I'm back with you. Um, book club didn't happen on Wednesday. I was not the only one who had not finished the book. So we've rearranged and lucky we rearranged for uh, August, which is actually after my holiday, we're going to Cornwall for our wedding anniversary. Ah, can you believe it's been a year since we got married? I really can't. Um, so I should have time to read it then. But anyway, so today is a day of cleaning. <laughs> Had a nice lazy breakfast, uh, caught up on some Master of None season two. Oh my god, I'm feeling quite emotional. Like, season one of Master of None on Netflix was good. Season two is just like amazing. Like, I don't know where that came from. It was like, oh, cute comedy thing. And then this is just, yeah, I'm having all the feels right now. If you've watched it, you'll, you'll know why I'm having all the feels. Um, <laughs> yeah, so um, we've had some breakfast, watched a little bit of TV whilst we're reading it because. That's what we do because we're terrible people. Um, and now I've got to clean the entire flat because we've got people coming over for dinner. Um, we've got friends coming for dinner. We've got Jess and Paige and Linda and Chris and Chris's brother and his other half, Phil and Phil. Uh, yeah, two Phil's a couple. Um, <laughs> and um, we are then gonna go and do some karaoke, have some drinks. I'm so looking forward to it, but we have to make our flat habitable for humans first. So cleaning clothes on, off I go. Okay, we have spent pretty much all day <laughs> cleaning the flat. I've now got a lovely tidy flat. I've had a wash because, God, it was hot work. Um, and I'm pretty much ready to go out now. Um, show you what I'm wearing. It's quite tricky to make a decision tonight because the weather is like really warm, but it's gonna get really, really rainy as soon as we go out. We're not going out, we're going out about eight o'clock, so it's meant to be tipping it down. But I've put a dress on anyway, because I figure we're gonna probably Uber it over there. <laughs> uh, I'll probably just put on some flats, to be honest, and probably a raincoat, I imagine. So Paul Pork is bubbling away downstairs. I've got to go make some potato wedges to go with it. I think we're pretty much there. I'm um, ready for people to arrive. Good morning, it's Sunday. I say morning, it's afternoon. Good afternoon, it's Sunday. Had an awesome night last night doing karaoke. Might be a little bit husky. Um, yeah, completely forgot. Our Uber arrived a lot quicker than expected and I ran out the door without my camera. So that was excellent vloggage there, but hope you enjoyed the shaky camera phone footage. Um, anyway, I am now heading off to Elizabeth's uh, Mendy party. So I'm back from Elizabeth's Mendy party. It was so much fun, it was lovely, and all the Mendy was so beautiful. Unfortunately, I couldn't have one because it had some essential oils in the henna mix, which I'm allergic to, which is a real shame. But they looked so beautiful. Elizabeth looked amazing. They're gonna look amazing for her wedding day. So now I've just got back home and uh, 
having a leftover samosa that Elizabeth parceled up for me um, for some tea. And uh, yeah, just gonna chill out and watch some TV for the rest of the evening. Thank you so much for watching this week. Like and subscribe for more weekly vlogs. Hopefully she'll be doing some other sorts of videos too, how I little horn planned and things. Um, and I'll see you again next week.